Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Phoenix Wright, Ace Attorney, Justice for All. In the last part, we totally just pwned Franziska von Karma, and she said she was going to punish Gumshoe. P punishment Well then, Your Honor, I think I've had all I can take of this detective's face. I think it's time to call in the next witness. Next witness? That's got to be Lada. That's gotta be Lada. Uh, whatever. All right, very well. The court will take a five-minute recess. After we reconvene, we will hear from the next witness. Doink. Smack. And to be continued. Too bad that last part didn't take so, like, it sucks how that last part took so long. I would have loved to end it on that to be continued. But anyway, as you know, you know, when you get the recesses, you get to save and stuff like that. Anyway, one thing I think I should mention, just really quick, um, in the middle of trials, like before you present evidence or answer a question, uh, you can actually save in the middle of a trial if you're getting like low on health and um, you know you're about to present a piece of evidence and you're not sure about it. You can actually save before you do that. So just letting you know. Ugh, that was a close one. I know you were giving it your all to defend me, but I could feel the death penalty hanging in the air. I felt like I was pretty close to dying myself. <laughs> But you were wonderful out there. You listened carefully, made theories, and tricked everyone into believing you. Th thanks. Wait, tricked? That must be the lawyer's secret technique, right? Uh, by the by, the way, is the next witness who I think it is? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's Waterheart. Oh, another jam, like always. Remember, Nick, you promised you'd save me. If you lose, my ghost will come after you with my sis and will haunt you. <laughs> Your sister? Um, are you talking about Mystic Mia? Yeah, do you remember her, Pearly? My sister was a super good lawyer. She was also Nick's teacher. Oh, I didn't know that. Alright, what's going on now? June 21st, yeah, yeah, district court, courtroom number two. Okay, we're already back in there now. Alright, what's going on now? Court will now reconvene. Now, the first order of... Ow! I don't want to hear it, old man. After I call my witness, sit there quietly and watch like a good little boy. Y yes sir Wow uh, You know that could get like contempt of court Like a thousand times over if this was a real court But whatever Bring in the photographer who has witnessed the channeling Alright we have a lot of heart now Wonderful Witness your name and occupation if you please Hey Phoenix how you doing Uh just fine Sorry about this Didn't exactly have a choice you know Yowza Name and occupation. I, I declare, what in tarnation? Hey, judge, this here's violence against my fair self. That's fine. That's fine? That ain't fine. That's a whip. Ah! There's no need for foolish outcries from foolishly foolish fools. Just hurry up and testify at what happened on the day of the murder. I haven't even gotten to say my name or job yet. <laughs> yeah. I would probably just... The name's not a heart. Very normal photographer, and I'm here to testify. Now, now, let's all be one big happy family, okay? <laughs> Jeez, one karma, you're a jerk. Alright, witnesses account. Only the doc and the defendant went into the channeling chamber. We were waiting outside the door, and then, bang, we hear a gun to this gunshot. Mr. Lawyer there broke the door down, we rushed into the room. Inside was the dead victim and the defendant, waving a pistol around. I swear, other than those two, there was no one else in the room. And did you take a picture of the scene right after the murder took place? Reckon course. Eh? Yeah? Excuse me? Reckon course. It's short for you reckon? Of course I did. Okay. Ah! Does it look like I care? Just hurry up and show your picture to the court. <laughs> the moment of truth. What will be in that picture? Um, let's see here. This here's the picture. Ah! Uh, yikes. Hmm. It would certainly seem that the, only the defendant and the victim were in that room. Hey, wait a minute. That couldn't have made sense. Remember when we broke in there, she... Uh, remember, just this is... Yeah, well, never mind. Don't worry about it. All right. Lotta's photo added to the court record. All right. Great. Are you ready, Mr. Phoenix Wright? I will clear all doubt about Maya through this cross-examination. Just watch me. All right. I hope we can. Cross-examination on the witness's account. All right, let's go ahead and start this. All right, only the dog and the defendant went into the channeling chamber. Hold it. I question that. Whatever. <laughs> Was it really only those two that went in? Objection! <laughs> what are you blabbering about? You were there too, were you not? Er, 
Why don't you answer that yourself? Was it really just the two of them? Yes, Dr. Gray and Maya are the only two who went in the room. <laughs> Hold on, we can't have the defense testifying against his own client. Anyway, folks, only the two of them went into the Janela chamber. You hear? But you knew that from the very beginning, didn't you? Witness, continue. <laughs> That's pretty funny. All right, we were waiting outside the door, and then bang, we hear this gunshot. That's why that broke the door down, we rushed into the room. Inside was a dead victim and the defendant waving a pistol around. Let's, let's ask there. Are you sure it was the defendant, Maya Fay? Sure, I'm sure. Wada seems awful confident in her testimony. Press harder. Wada, please, think back to the day one more time. What you getting at? Remember what you said when we broke into the room? Ah, I remember. He's like, hey, is that Maya? I was murdered. Click. Yeah, yeah, we got it. Alright, Lada, at a time like this? Times like this are perfect, it's not having no shots. But anyway, what's going on here? That girl, is this girl, is this Maya? So she wasn't all that sure. When you saw the murderer at that time, you couldn't even tell if it was Maya Faye or not. Am I correct? Ah, um, well, you see. Huh, well, there we go. There's already a hole in it. Order, Miss Hart, you are here to present accurate present accurate testimony. Yeah, uh, sorry. Good, this shifts things back to my side. For a defense lawyer, your defense is terribly lacking, Mr. Phoenix Wright. Witness, think back to when those two entered the channeling chamber. When they entered? One of those people that entered the channel chamber was Maya Fay, correct? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, it was Maya that went in. Hmm. It looks like we've come to a collective conclusion. The person in this picture is most certainly Maya Fay. Exactly. Rat, I, I trapped like one. Again. Alright, let's see. I swear, other than those two, there was no one else in the room. Well, let's see here. Are you absolutely certain of that? Sure am, but that old witch chases out of the room, so... Old witch? Does she mean Morgan Fay? But there was no one else in there, and you'd know it. The channeling chamber was very dark, almost pitch black. Was there really no one else in there? What about... Hmm... What about... Behind... Oh wait, behind the folding screen. Why not that? What about behind the folding screen? Did you check back there? Rick Ivan! Huh? What in the... Rick Ivan, you know. You reckon? That's a given. I took, I took me a good look around once... I took me a good look around the room once. There ain't no... There ain't no way anyone was hanging out behind that folding screen. Hmm. If I may have a word with you, Miss Hart. What? You got a problem? Rick Ivan. I mean... <laughs> Rick Ivan! I mean, I'm having a little difficulty understanding you. That is awesome! <laughs> if you would stop saying such things as Rick Ivan... Ah! Now, now then, Mr. Phoenix Wright, you see a problem with the testimony, or don't you? Ah, her story adds up. It's worse that I was there at the scene of the crime that time, too. And her story is exactly how I would have told it. Only the doc and the defendant wouldn't... Okay, well, we need to ask right there again. So, here. Other than those two, no one else is in the room. We need to ask again. So, are you absolutely certain of that? I sure am, but that old witch just out of the room. Old witch, Morgan Fay. Right. What about under the flooring? What about under the flooring? Did you check there? I ain't no ignoramus to make it out here. Huh? What are you talking about? Don't... What are you talking about me? Under the flooring? Come on, even a bug wouldn't crawl under that. Sorry to disappoint, but there was no secret passageway under the flooring. Oh, yeah. That was a bit far-fetched, huh? Ah, her story adds up. Alright, well, let's see here. We have evidence. So, let's see here. Bought this photo. Let's take a check. Let's check this out. Hmm. I guess for now, all we can really do is just question her testimony. So, uh, waiting outside, and then bang, we hear this gunshot. Let's see here. Crap, this is probably going to go into half part. Was it really a gunshot? Objection! Objection. <laughs> Are you insane? You must have heard it as well. <laughs> Why don't you testify for the court, Mr. Phoenix Wright? Was it really a gunshot? Yes, I think it was something like it sounded like a gunshot. And why are we here listening to the defense testify? And the world becomes just a little crueler. <laughs> I heard a gunshot a long time ago, so I know. And I tell you, that was a gunshot I heard. 
Now, this. This is where the story heats up. Alright, well, let's see here. I think we're getting a little bit too close to the time limit now, so I'm going to end it off here. In the next part, we're going to continue with Lada's testimony, so I'll see you guys later.